Okay, I'm installing a new external hard or internal hard drive on my MacBook by Western Digital. I'm gonna take the battery out. And there's three little screws right here. Just have to pop these out. This little metal housing comes off. And the hard drive is right in here. Where that little paper thing is. And just pull it right out. There's the old one. So it installed. Let me try it this way. Okay. Hmm. Then so you just want to put the metal housing back in. You use the quarter you used earlier to this little cloth like material. You have to push it, squeeze it. Push it down. We're done. So now I'm just going to install the OS. It's probably going to come up with a question mark. It says no bootable device. Insert boot disk and press any key. I guess that's the kernel UI. Guess what you have to do is just hold down the C key when you boot. It froze up or something when I put the CD in afterwards, so I force shut off and I just turn it back on and I'm holding on the C key right now. And it's booting up. So hopefully I'll be able to install it all. Uh-oh.
Okay, so, uh, okay, so, uh, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is, I don't think it's gonna recognize, uh, it's not gonna recognize when you just trying to go into install. So what you have to do is from Finder, or whatever it would be called, you go to, uh, Utilities. Open up Disk Utilities, is it. It, it recognizes it, it's here. So, I think what I have to do is just, Erase it and format it as a Mac OS 10 or Mac OS format. It's probably a that there's two format right now. So it's formatting it now. Okay, it's formatted. Cool. Yep, yep, and it's now recognized. Cool. Sweet! Let it work its thing. Okay. Done installing now. Let's see what happens.